What's up YouTube and welcome to a brand new GTA 5 Online video from the Stush Life Gaming channel. As you can see on your screen there's been an update for GTA Online and this time around it's the San Andreas Super Sports Series update. It's roughly about 1GB in size, maybe a little bit bigger depending on your platform. It didn't take too long to uh, download it my PS4 um, mostly it looks like there's some pretty new cool cars some awesome sports cars we'll get into those in a second as you can see some of the supercars that are on your screen right now the entity double XR is an absolute well it's a real treat I've uh, been looking forward to a new overflow the autarch was awesome but this entity double XR really it's really the bomb so yeah I'm looking forward to getting getting many fun drives out of that vehicle as you can see heading over to Southern San Andreas Super Autos there's the new De Class Hot Ring Sabre that will of course go uh, be pretty useful on the new map or the new mode that uh, has been introduced with tons of new maps and uh, there's also the Volca Fagaloa I don't know if many people will purchase that but it's a pretty trippy vehicle We'll have to see how the community um, takes Snapmatics and makes use of this as a car. But yeah, an interesting update so far. What's on your screen now is um, me doing a few modifications to the Vapid GB200. This vehicle is coming in at 940,000 GTA dollars, so plus modifications. It's not cheap um, for a little sports car like this but having driven it a little bit I haven't tested it properly in races and and whatnot but it is a, a definitely around town it's um, driving around Los Santos it's an awesome little sports vehicle surely to be involved in some cool races and some cool snapmatics as the community gets their hands on this bit of kit but yeah you can see some of the mods the tons of modifications and cool things that you can add on to the uh, car the Vapid GB200 uh, it's a sort of rally sports car as you can see from the mods that I'm putting on there and yeah uh, all around really excited and happy with this car I think it's going to be a good addition to the game so I'm happy to see it included uh, some of the great liveries there you can see I ended up going with the Spronk livery. Uh, moving on, uh, the next big car that I picked up from Southern San Andreas Autos was the De Class Hot Ring Sabre. Um, another sports car almost is it NASCAR I think it's like NASCAR is the type of um, vehicle that it reminds me of uh, Chiliad's Peak Raceway that was a very NASCAR-ish type race just basically going around in a circle as you'll see later in the video but yeah the uh, De Class Sabre it's got some awesome liveries that you can pick from I went with the Republican Space Rangers one here that's Tried to pick a collar that went with it as well, make it stand out. But that's another cool vehicle coming in at $830,000. It's another not cheap sports car. Moving on, there's the Cheval Taipan. Uh, another supercar that's been added to the game. Uh, looks awesome, looks really nice um, and it's great to look at. I have driven it around uh, Los Santos a little bit, didn't find it to be the most exciting of supercars if I'm honest. Maybe that's because we're spoilt by the Overflood uh, Entity XR coming out today but still visually it's going to 
look great for Snapmatics and I'm sure there's going to be some great races where this uh, new Cheval is going to fit into and it's going to, you know, find its purpose in La Santos amongst the other supercars that are um, already established. I'm sure it will it'll find its own way. There's tons of enhancements for the car. And as you can see at the exit screen, it looks pretty damn good. So yeah, happy about that car as well. But obviously the highlight for me is the Overflood Entity XXR. This is pretty much a king of supercars. Uh, the Trofard Nero impressed me, but the Overflood Entity XXR is definitely an impressive, not just looking vehicle. I used to drive it around and try it in a couple of races earlier. And it really is an impressive, both in exciting uh, handling, uh, exciting performance and just exciting looks. I mean, it's going to look great in Snapmatics. It's going to look fantastic in videos and it's going to probably be one of the more popular cars. I think of recent times, but $2,305,000, it's, whoa, it's definitely not cheap. And I forgot to mention earlier that the Cheval Taipan is one point nine or $1,980,000, so today's update isn't cheap at all, but you will be getting a lot of cool stuff for your money. Also in today's update is some new racing suits. Um, part of the San Andreas Super Sports Series update. You can get these classic racing suits and some pretty fire out colors. White classic, red classic and so on. And of course, the new mode, the hot ring circuit is uh, the new mode that's come out today as well. And um, I found the map that I played, as I mentioned earlier, Chiliad Peak Raceway. I found this map to be um, a bit dull, non-contact. It was a bit of a boring race. But I think with contact on and some good racers involved, I think this will be a pretty damn good um, new mode and it will be a welcome addition to the um, GTA Online Racing Circuit. Also Rockstar have announced there's going to be some pretty cool new content coming out over the next few weeks. One of those will be the new Target Assault mode that's coming on April the 3rd, a frantic race for up to two play eight teams of two players each, so we'll have to see how that one plays out, that should be exciting. There's a new update on May the 1st with some new content to check out. So that's another date keeping your diaries. And Rockstar promises more coming soon. So it will be really interesting to see what the new content is. But yeah, thanks for checking out today's video. Don't forget to subscribe and drop the video a like if you enjoyed it. And I'll catch you guys for a new video soon.